Hey guys, it's your boy Vibag with more Mouth Fish Bite content. Today's video, we are taking a look at Thanos in Timeline Battle Auto with the CDP of Regen. Obsidian Thanos is here, boys, and with the new leadership, he does not need the debuff removal, so we don't really need Wasp. Although using Wasp is a nice option because of the 20 or 30 percent extra HP, but I think this will be the best team up for Thanos alone because of the Colossus passive, which helps out uh, all around with every character, and then Hela helping out against those Spideys and all those heroes like sentries as well in timely battle let's just take a look and see how that goes so for the stats we have ma basically everything maxed out uh skill cooldown is okay i would say 44 percent or 45 percent skill cooldown is ne uh, nice for thanos for pvp and then all the stats are pretty good as well we don't really have any odin's blessing right now on the guy critical damage all the skills are level six of course Tap Enhancement rank 4, we have Power of Angry Hull stage 10, so I'm gonna keep it like this, no artifact yet, and then we have the normal CTP of regeneration with not very good stats, the max HP is very low, 23%, still. We have the legendary uniform and the uniform options of course are the Crescent, we have Storm roll for HP, Odin roll for HP, we have War Machine roll for Dodge, and then the last one is gonna be the Marvel Studios Black Widow Red Guardian uniform, which you can roll maybe for attack or something. For the cards right now, we are taking a look at 33.6% uh, HP as well as 25% all defense, so decent stats, not something OP. Let's take a look at how he does against all of those crazy teams in Tamil Battle, and let's see how he performs. So, first of all, of course, I'm gonna go against Vicky. You might have uh, might have known him from the Tamlan Challenger League, so it's gonna be uncut. I'm not gonna edit this video at all. I'm gonna totally autoplay Thanos from start to finish, and let's see how he performs. Okay. We have a sentry with a... Okay, that's actually brilliant regen. And you can see he's definitely tanking the hits. And he kills. Okay, sentry is gone. The four skill, one shot sentry. He starts with the four skill. He starts one shot the sentry. Adam Warlock. And Adam, 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 Adam. <laughs> Adam gets one shot it. Okay, one more. Adam is one shotted. Okay. Hela. Hi, Hela. Hela might actually kill her. No, not really. Artifact. Tier 3 skill is available now. And he kills Hela. Oh my god. Oh my god. The Obsidian King Thanos is here. Damn. This does look insane, dude. Wow. I did not expect him to perform this good. Dude, this is definitely, well, yeah, we expected him to be uh, OP, but okay. A5A King j -Ord, you might have seen in Challenger as well. Let's see how he performs against this team up. So we have Sentry with probably a Brilliant, I guess. Yeah, that's a Brilliant again. We have Adam Warlock and Hela. You can see Sentry is doing like, yeah, he's taking the hits and the 20% HP recovery is insane. He's one-shotting Sentry with the uh, fourth skill here. Look at that. He's literally one-shotting. Fifth skill does insane damage and then gets it done with the second skill. Adam comes around and then Adam... Okay, might kill... Might kill the... He <laughs> gets the full HP back. He gets the full HP back. Okay, once again. Let's see. He's gonna get one-shotted. Yep, he does. Yes, he does. Oh my god, and Corvus appears in that in that skill. That is insane. Hela is gonna die. Oh my god, this artifact is not gonna save you, Miss Hela. You're done for the day. He is living up to his name, okay? Thanos is back at the top tier of the PvP meta, guys, and... Woo! This looks awesome, actually. Okay, let me fight some other guys. Okay, allies. Uh... Let's see if we can find some some uh, crazy crazy uh, crazy guys as well. Okay, I'm gonna go for the Korea guy, I guess. Oh, it's the same team. Okay, it's the Spidey team, but it does not have any debuff. So I'm gonna remove this one. Let's fight against Doctor Doom and let's see how it does. Doctor Doom, Hela, and Colossus. Of course, Hela will not work against Thanos in our team, but that is okay. We have Doctor Doom with the Agreed. Okay. Whoa! Oh, that that was crazy damage. That was nice damage actually. But one shots. Doctor Doom, one shots Doctor Doom, and one shots him once more. Oh boy, it it will be interesting to see how he does against like a mighty region or maybe a mighty authority or a brilliant authority, Doctor Doom. But he is one shotting every single one. 
Proxima comes, use, does the fifth skill. Also, Corvus comes, does the fourth skill, and one shots every single guy, every single character in his path. Okay, right now we are on a win streak. He's not losing at all from any of the character. Let's fight some challenger guys. Okay, let's start from um, commander. Okay, let's start from commander. We have Hela leadership. Okay, let's see. Well. We don't really do need to do that because he would, you know, that's just without the debuff, but I'll just fight it just to see how much he handles the damage output because Hela is going to give 60% extra energy attack to all of these characters. And he also is rocking a mighty regen probably on Thana. Uh, Thana. Hela. Okay. That could have actually killed Thanos. Okay. He did get the HP back though. And he is really close to killing Hela here as well. Does the fourth skill and... Woo! He actually survived a lot. Okay, we have Sentry here. And Sentry is gonna go... Bye-bye, Sentry. One-shots. One-shots the Sentry. Okay. Fourth skill. One-shots the Sentry once again. We have another... We have another brilliant... Yeah. Brilliant. We have another brilliant... Uh, I was gonna say Adam Warlock. Brilliant regen, Adam Warlock. And he just kills it. It's like every single of his skills is gonna be one-shotting every single character that you fight. This is OP, okay? This is literally OP. Let's fight someone else. We have Ball Ball, okay? Carl C, yeah, let's see. We have probably a brilliant region, Sentry, a brilliant region or Authority, Adam Warlock as well as Hela. Let's see how he deals with Carl C, yeah. okay? Okay, it's actually not. It's actually greed. It's a brilliant greed and brilliant greed actually one-shots the Thanos. Okay. Brilliant greed sentry one-shots the Thanos. Okay. I want to try this uh, team up once more. Let's just, let's just let the Hela die here. Please Hela die. Uh, quickly. I want to test it out. Uh, the reason why I want to test it out is actually I'm gonna be switching to a different character and then switch back to Thanos to see how he does because Thanos does not have any skills when Sentry does that skill, right? So I'm gonna go again, fight the Carl CL. Here we go, come on, come on, where's Carl CL? Let's go and fight the team once again, okay? I'm gonna switch to the second character, let it die and then uh, come back with Thanos once more, okay? I'm gonna switch to Colossus and let Colossus die. I'm gonna let Colossus die and now let's see how he does. Okay, still uh, fourth skill one shots the sentry. Okay, now it's he's back. He's back once more, and oh one shots the sentry. Okay, Adam Warlock. We have okay. We have a CDP of energy. Adam Warlock gets one shotted. If Adam Warlock gets on the well, he can definitely one shot me as well. But Thanos takes care of him, and then Hela comes around, and Hela is not gonna survive against Thanos. He just stays there. Well, he she might. She's dead. No, she's not. But she is gonna be dead now. Okay, if you have, if you are in an even situation, if you have the skill cooldowns and skills available, it seems like he can definitely take all those hits. That definitely caught me off guard with the brilliant greed. But let's see. We already fought Vicky. Uh, let's go for Arthur. Okay, let's see Arthur what he has. He having the same team with the... This is the meta actually. This is the absolute meta. I have not been able to fight any Spideys. I'll try to fight some Spideys though. I heard that Spidey is actually a nice counter. We again, we have uh, Greed right there. Brilliant Greed on Sentry once again. And now Thanos actually one shots the guy. That is awesome. And he gets the HP back, that is nice, and one shot the sentry once again, Adam Warlock comes in, and then, is he gonna get one shotted? He gets one shotted, he gets one freaking shotted by this guy. He's not gonna stop, he's not gonna stop, he's gonna consume Adam Warlock as well, the damage is not enough, and then Adam Warlock dies, Hela comes in, fourth skill, clutches out, artifact saves Hela, but it's gonna be insane, it's game over Hela, you are gone, <laughs> he's back. He's literally back. Oh my goodness. 20, the 20% 20 heal is very good actually. Helps out. Do we have any more uh, guys in this league? Vibranium. We I don't see any. On, okay. Uh, Smack actually has a nice team up. We have okay. So basically we are going with Thanos without any debuffs or anything because of the Molecule Man. So this is just Thanos versus this team without any buffs or debuffs. Which is gonna be insane. Okay, interesting to see. Can he even live up to the expectation? You can see Molecule Man is doing insane damage. He could actually kill Thanos, but Thanos is here. 
Fourth skill, one shot, Molecule Man. Okay, he comes in. We have the authority. He might kill him. He might kill him. He might kill him. He kills him. Okay, in the end. So without the debuff, sadly, he died because he caught off guard in the iframe and he did not actually have other skills available. So still nice. A great performance, actually. Even without the debuffs, he was able to take one full life of Adam Warlock and could have been able to. So it's not like he is... Like, it's not like you are unable to counter. There are counters to Thanos, but it's just like it's very hard to counter them. I want to fight a team which actually has uh, Spidey, if I can. Okay, Adam, Spidey, and we have uh, Hela. Let's check out this team. Adam, Spidey, and Hela, and let's see how he does against Spider-Man as well. Okay, uh, we have uh, another, actually, authority. Seems like a brilliant, I guess. It's a brilliant, right? Uh, let me know if I'm wrong. It seems like a brilliant authority on this guy. But I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Let's see. One shots. Spidey comes in, has the... Again, authority. Spidey has the authority once again. And actually, Spidey not able to kill him out. One shots. Gets one shotted by Thanos. And then Hela comes up. Nearly get one shotted. Artifact saves her, but that's not gonna save her for more. And then gets one shotted. Gets eaten by Thanos once more. Let's do one last battle on the autoplay. And let's uh, call it a video. for And call it a showcase for this one. I'm gonna go against uh, someone else from the challenger, actually. Uh, Frankie, we have uh, King J. Or we already fought him. We have Favor Faves. We have. Uh, wait a second. Who else do we have? Arthur, we already fought Arthur. King J. We already did that. Uh, Vivi Doom is a nice player as well. Favor Faves is nice. Okay. Can I can I go here? Yellow Flash. Uh, okay. Favor. Let's go against Favor. Okay. Last team up, last uh, fight. Let's see how he performs on auto. Uh, as far as uh, it's concerned, the performance is insane. And it looks like nearly unkillable. But I will not say quite unkillable. He definitely struggles with the, some iframes if he does not have the 4 skill. Because that's the only iframe ignore skill that he has. But still does insane amount of damage. We Again, we have a mighty on this guy. And the sentry is still gonna get freaking one-shotted right there with the 4 skill. 5th skill comes in and... The good thing is that 5th skill actually doesn't... Okay. Almost kill Thanos. Almost kill Thanos. Adam. Adam Warlock. We have... Okay, it's a ch energy. CDP of energy. That's why the damage was so good. And now Hela is here. She's gonna get obliterated by Thanos. Or she might not. Okay, she might actually kill him. But no. Nah, she's not gonna kill him. Nah. Obsidian Thanos is here, guys. That will be the showcase for Tamlin Battle Autoplay. I'll do one for Ultron as well soon. And of course, we will be checking him out in ABX as well. At least for PvP, he is probably the best PvP character in the whole game right now. At least from the performance. Yes, he can still be killed. He still can be countered. But it's going to be very hard. And keep in mind, all of that was with the normal energy. With a 23% max HP roll. So mighty or brilliant... He's gonna literally shred everyone without the artifact, without the full ISO 8 set, without any Odin's blessings on him and the legendary uniform. So I think there is a lot of room to grow for Obsidian Thanos, the best PvP character in the game right now, in my opinion, gets one. He can die, but he can kill every single meta in the game he is the meta breaker right now so let me know in the comment section what you think about the video let me know what you think about the obsidian thanos and look at this guy oh my god it looks insane and as always if you do enjoy the content i hope to see you again take care i'll see you all in the next one the guy is back